In this video, I will show you how to show variants as separate products on the Shopify collection page. Let's get started. So as of right now, I have this specific products. And for example, for this particular product, I have two selections, which is actually a green shirt and a blue shirt. So if you want to actually show in here the blue shirt, what you can do is you can head over in here on your products in Shopify, click on that particular product. And then once you have clicked on that, you should be able to edit it out however you want. Now in here, you can see the variant. So click on edit right here and I will delete it first because I will not need it. Now in here, let's add a new variant and it will be a color variant. So let's name it as blue and the other one as green. And then let's save this. Once it's been saved, you can see this one. So you can click on this blue right here and then add in here a file that you want to add. So for this one, I'll add a simple file from my actual local computer and then as you can see it will upload this one and then once it's done uploading you can actually select the check mark right here and click on done after that click on this icon right here for the green and then let's add a particular picture then once you have done that this will load like this one and then once it's done loading head over and click on the save option so click on save product right here and then this will be saved. And now we have these two options. Next thing we need to do is we need to head over in here to our Shopify online store. Now in this, we can head over and see our actual store from this. Click on this three dots, click on this edit code, and then in here it will open the code. So let me just try to minimize it and look for snippets. Click on this add new snippet, and then let's name it as card stash variant once you have named that just click on done and then in here it will open a new code now you just need to head over to this particular link right here once you have done that you can see this code click on copy right here then head over to your shopify and then just paste the code that you have copied in here and then after that just save the progress that you have for this one so let's save this and then once you have done that, it's been saved. Now, next thing you need to do is to just look for the main collection product kit. So click on this filter files right here and search in here for main dash collection. And you can see in here the product grid. So just click on that. And then once you have done that, you can see in here the actual code for that specific product grid. Now, what you can do is you can click on any part of this and then click on control F. And then you just need to find a simple thing. Look in here for the card dash product. And then once you have done that, you can see in here. So this is the actual code for this particular thing. So just select this code for the list and then remove it. And then once it's been deleted, next thing you need to do is you head over to this particular link right here. And then copy this code. And then let's head back right here to the coding and let's paste the code that we have copied. Once you have done that, just scroll up until you can see in here the options for your product variants. So you can see in here the option for color. So make sure that you choose a right name that you have for your specific store. So as you can see right here, the variant is titled color. So let's also put in here color. After that, click on save option right here. And then once you have done that, this will save that particular asset. Now let's head over to our product to our actual store. And then let's refresh this side. And then just refresh it as you do. And then it will actually just take some time for this actual code to take effect on your store. And for your product to actually display on the collection grid for your store. But once it's done, you should be able to see it right from your store added as a particular product right here. So that's the whole process. If you have found this video helpful, simply leave a like below or subscribe because it helps reach more people. See you soon.